Welcome to the next generation of decentralized computing network in AI era. Welcome to my slicing pool. One of the projects that is making a lot of news recently on the internet computer is EMC. What is it about? In this video, we want to dive into it. We're going to talk about what the project is about. We're going to talk about the token and we're going to talk about mining that token. So keep watching. There's a lot to learn. First, we want to talk about this project, what it is about. And we want to talk about it in a way that everybody understands. Or in other words, the layman way. So we're just going to make it really simple. EMC means edge metric computing. This is a revolutionary project where computer power is totally decentralized so that anyone can take part and share their own computer power. Just so apps, especially artificial intelligent apps can run on the internet computer. EMC is an easy and secure network. Simply download and install a software on your computer and it will automatically start contributing computing power, CPU, GPU, storage, and bandwidth to EMC network. Decentralized computing is used in artificial intelligence, data analysis, game industry, video render, financial services, healthcare, and scientific research. EMC provides a decentralized network for buying and selling computing resources, allowing anyone to contribute their unused computing power to the network and earn rewards in return. Users can earn tokens by contributing computing resources and they can use tokens to pay for computing server resources, applications, or services on EMC in very basic terms. In very basic terms, EMC is a decentralized computing network. Okay, think of it like Bitcoin, but this one is about computing power, not mining Bitcoin and stuff like that. It's like Bitcoin, but focus on computing power. So there's so many nodes. Nodes are computers. There's so many nodes all over the world providing computing power for applications to run in a decentralized manner. This is what it's about. It's an amazing idea, it's an amazing project, and there's a lot to happen here. But this is the most basic way to understand it. Now, recently, EMC has a program that we run on our local network. It's called Stable Diffusion. This program is one example of a program where people can run locally and then other people in other parts of the world can use the computer resources of those running this program. So if you install and launch your stable diffusion program on your computer, then anyone with your node ID, anyone anywhere in the world can be able to to use your computer resources and run AI, AI stuff. Um, we have an example where people can use your node ID to generate AI images, images about anything you want, anything you like. So whenever you generating images, it's taking a lot of computer power, but this power is someone else's power somewhere else in the world and that person's gonna hear the computer heating up heating up and really heating up meanwhile is someone else somewhere else using these resources 
So this is what this is about EMC network. Next, let's talk about the EMC token, which is EMC, the token. The token is very important in this network because there's a lot to do with it. First, we should know a total supply of 2.1 billion tokens, and they say it's homage to Bitcoin. What, what do you do with this token? In the computing marketplace, people who hold EMC can use it to purchase computing resources and computing nodes can accept EMC as a payment method for transactions. This trading method reduces transaction cost and time and improves the liquidity and utilization of computing resources. In addition to serving as a medium of exchange, EMC can also be used to reward the contribution of idle computing power to the network, subsidize buyers of computing power, and incentivize developers to contribute to the ecosystem. Smart contracts can be used to automate the management of computing resources and rewards, ensuring fair allocation of resources. In the EMC ecosystem, EMC can be used in various application scenarios such as decentralized AI application, blockchain games, and blockchain storage. These application scenarios can use EMC to achieve more flexible and efficient resource management and trading methods, thereby improving the efficiency and performance of blockchain applications. So we can see clearly there's a lot of use cases for this token, a lot of use cases. And not to mention that the token is trading right now. It's trading right now on ICSwap, which is a decentralized exchange on the internet computer. And there's a lot of interest in the token as well. People are really looking forward to getting more of the token and seeing where the project leads. Next is EMC mining. How do we mine EMC? In order to mine, we need two programs, Stable Diffusion and EMC Client. These two programs must be downloaded. We're gonna provide the link in the comment section. Once you download these programs and run them, you'll be able to mine EMC. And remember that these programs must be running simultaneously in order for mining to work. If you successfully do that, then you will be able to share your computer power with other people around the world. And at the same time, people will be able to use your computer power to generate images uh, using the local program. Uh, stable diffusion, they will be able to generate images from other parts of the world using your computer power. That is something amazing. We can use the node ID of the miner to generate images, uh, whatever image we want, whatever we want to see, whatever AI image we want to create, we can just type down the prompt and then it will be generated. And that is using someone else's computer resources or computer power from another part of the world. So that is the amazing part about this project. We can generate as many images as we want. So once they, they the miners, are sharing this computer power, the earning rewards so uh, the people using the computer power at some point they will have to pay for it too and that brings in the utility of uh, uh, the EMC token a stable diffusion it's an example project that showcases how the EMC network works 
uh, showcases how you can launch a program locally and then have people from all over the world share in your computer power um, from anywhere in the world so uh, and you know if someone is using your computer power then you would notice it of course every time they're using your computer power you can hear it on especially for low level uh, GPU computers you hear the noise it goes really buzzing buzzing and you can feel it you can see that someone is using up that power right there somewhere in the world generating AI images so that's it and soon enough there's gonna be um, and additionally there's gonna be uh, EMC hub EMC hub is uh, definitely where a lot of it's like a EMC market where a lot of things are gonna be happening sharing of computer resources uh, buying of computer resources using the EMC token which we talked about so we can notice uh, everything has been put in place for this project to uh, come out really successfully it has a lot of potential and of course um, we're just gonna wait wait it out see how it works out and this is just amazing thinking about it and looking at all the potentials in the pipeline I hope this video was helpful if it was don't forget to subscribe there's gonna be more of this kind of video so if you're new on the internet computer or in crypto or whatever subscribe we're gonna bring more slices thank you for watching see you again in another slice